Because today I'll tell you all about the Diary of Anne Frank, the new Broadway show I'm doing this fall. Another familiar history lesson concerning hate and racism has returned to Broadway. The Diary of Anne Frank opened Thursday night, and this time it is starring one of the hottest young stars in Hollywood. As Cynthia Tornquist reports, Natalie Portman may be 16, but she has absolutely no trouble relating to her character. What are you writing in there that's so funny? What? I can't take a peek. No, Mrs. Van Dan. Not even a little peek. Not even a little peek, Mrs. Van Dan. Natalie Portman, who was born in Jerusalem and grew up on Long Island, brings a unique perspective to her role in the diary of Anne Frank. My grandfather's little brother and his parents were both killed and were all killed in concentration camps. And uh, most of my extended family was killed in the Holocaust. The 16-year-old actress makes her Broadway debut as Anne Frank. Until now, her career had been confined to Hollywood as Timothy Hutton's darling in Beautiful Girls, the orphan adopted by a hitman in The Professional, and Goldie Hawn in Alan Alda's daughter in the Woody Allen musical, Everyone Says I Love You. By virtue of the fact that you portray Anne Frank, that really puts you in the spotlight here. How much pressure does that put on you? It makes it more exciting. I constantly have that, you know, adrenaline running through me and um, some like little weird, sometimes, you know, kids will ask me to sign the diary and that's really weird for me. I always say to them, you know, I didn't write this. <laughs> and Frank died from typhus in Bergen-Belsen concentration camp days before the liberation and the end of World War II. After the war, her father, Otto, recovered her diary. It has been translated into 55 languages, adapted into a Broadway play in 1955, made into a film in 1959. In this new adaptation, we see Anne, warts and all. She was a good person. She had great, a great set of ideals. But at the same time, she, she had her conflicts with everyone in the attic. Yes, mother! This version includes elements of the diary that Anne's father cut out of the first printing. She talks about, you know, her, her sexual feelings and, and also um, things about how she hates her mother, which, I mean, she didn't hate her mother, but there were times when she felt like it. Here's an IOU I promise to pay. Ten hours of doing whatever you say. Natalie Portman first read Anne Frank's diary when she was 12 years old. At age 16, she brings her understanding of the young woman to the stage. Cynthia Tornquist, CNN Entertainment News, New York.